Hi everyone in the world of cloud computing, here are a few tech news highlights from this week. I'm Brad Nelson of Nelson Hilliard, cloud computing recruitment specialist placing great people in cloud, IoT, fintech and AI. Thank you all for your support on social media and subscribing to our blogs and YouTube videos. We are now on iTunes with our podcasts. Of all the shows and the news, below there is a link. Watch out for the new weekly cloud computing shows with David Linthicum, who is the world's number one cloud industry expert and internationally recognized thought leader. And don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share these videos with your friends and your colleagues. This week, according to Oracle and KPMG, 82% of cyber professionals are worried that employees are not following cloud security policies. With the shift to cloud becoming a business imperative for the large majority of companies, according to a report from Oracle and KPMG, 87% of public and private organizations now have a cloud-first initiative in place. Of the 450 cybersecurity and IT professionals worldwide surveyed in the report, the vast majority, i.e. 90%, said that at least half of their cloud data is sensitive information. 41% of organizations said they now have a dedicated cloud security architect on their staff. This week, IBM launches new cloud-ready mainframe computers. IBM has launched two new mainframes, the IBM Z14 model ZR1 and the IBM Linux One Rockhopper 2. IBM Z Systems servers are said to dominate the mainframe market with 90% of market share. The mainframe remains for many the most stable and secure and mature environment to support IT initiatives, including the proliferation of blockchains, says IBM. The company claims 80% of all credit card transactions and nearly $8 trillion in payments a year are processed on mainframes. Furthermore, the platform manages 29 billion ATM transactions each year, the equivalent to nearly five billion US dollars per day. This week sees Alibaba Cloud expands into Turkey. Alibaba Cloud announced an expansion into Turkey alongside new partner eGloba. eGloba is the only authorized agent and business partner of Alibaba.com in Turkey. It will provide their local connections and insights with Alibaba Cloud's global infrastructure. Alibaba is pushing its Elastic Compute service with this, citing an IDC study which found the public cloud market was worth almost 97 million US dollars in 2017. The company also see Turkey as a gateway nation between East and West. Yeming Wang, Deputy General Manager of Alibaba Cloud Global said in a statement that Alibaba Cloud has always been dedicated to making future-proof technology inclusive within the markets in which we operate. We aim to become the preferred cloud service provider for all sizes of businesses in Turkey by providing a full range of cloud solutions and combining this with eGloba's local expertise. This week, HPE has acquired the UK company Red Pixie, adding Azure skills to its cloud consulting arm. The acquisition will fall under the remit of HPE Pointnext, the company's services business. Anna Pinkzerk, SVP and GM of HPE Pointnext wrote that with this acquisition, we will continue to expand our comprehensive hybrid IT portfolio and will be even better positioned to help our customers build new digital experiences and drive better business outcomes now and into the future. In September 2017, the company bought cloud technology partners whose focus is more on the Amazon Web Services side. I'm Brad Nelson of Nelson Hilliard, cloud computing recruitment specialist placing great people in cloud, IoT, fintech and AI. I hope you enjoyed watching this week's news and remember to like, subscribe, comment and share this video with your friends and your colleagues. You can also connect with me on LinkedIn, find us on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram and also check out our latest shows with David Linthicum and the podcast in the link in the description box below. Until next week, be good, be safe and keep our clouds secure.